Hello and welcome to our Monday Monslay. I'm your coach, Jennifer Nicoli. We're going to get right into it. It is challenge week and I want to say hello. Just going to tag a couple of our friends who believes in miracles. I'm so excited to get this party started. Hello, Monica. Good morning. I got my beautiful love glasses on because it's all about love, love, love. All right. It is challenge week. So let's just give a big praise up and say thank you. Thank you for our strong, healthy minds and bodies. And listen, today is Halloween Candy Crusher. Halloween hit, and we're gonna hit it hard. High intensity interval training at its best. Right now, ask yourself this question. How can I be a better VIP queen? How can I make every second count? Good morning, Jesse and Kate. Good morning, Monica. Bonfire Bonnie. How can I be a better woman, mother, friend, coworker, teacher, VIP queen, VIP sister, mentor? The answers are all here, okay? Because you have the sunshine inside of you. Hello, Jennifer Berenger Newcomb. We love you. Angela, love your 100 reps. Love your graphic. We're going to be swinging into this week. You like my... My critter creation, compliments of Jesse and Kay. We're gonna be swinging into this week with some positive energy. Okay, so this week is challenge week. What does that mean? Where you challenge yourself. You're gonna challenge yourself to do 100 reps of your choice. And let me tell you what, once you get started, you can't stop. I'm actually gonna be warming it up on my air stepper, which I absolutely love. Take a big inhale with me, queens. And let's get going right here, right now. So I just want to say, I already have my reps selected, okay? No candy for me. All of this is just sugar, filler. We're taking out all the unnecessary calories, carbs that you don't need because you're sweet enough. You're sweet enough, okay, queens? And guess what? Trick or treat, the gifts are for you. I'm so thrilled to announce that we are going to be doing tons of giveaways okay this thursday at one o'clock i'm doing an amazon live with the beauty box and guess what partial proceeds of everything that i earn this month it will be matched to give to mama trixie's charity talk about miracles and our cup runneth over so i just wanted to say thank you to our generous sponsor and don't miss this panel this friday we've got mama trixie and dr jan Thelma and louise so this week is gonna be amazing. Rep week, Mama Trixie, Dr. Jan, and Norma's giving away two books, and of course the beauty box. I'm so grateful. So as you guys get those positive vibes up, I want you to listen to these rules of success. You have a choice to get up and say thank you, and that's what you're doing right here, right now. Okay, here comes Coach Payne. Coach j &L, Tough Love Coach. Here I go. Don't take this personal, but sometimes I gotta give you a little pat, pat, pat on the fanny. How dare anyone out there not wanna get out of bed? There's people in the hospital begging for your opportunity that you have. Healthy mind and body, strong feet, strong hands. You're not in a wheelchair. You're not in crutches. Get up and get moving, okay? Coach Payne is here. This is tough love, Coach j &L. Sometimes I gotta give you that swift kick and that motivational kick in the butt. There's people out there who would just be begging for your opportunity. So, you have a choice. When you hit the ground, say thank you for my strong feet. When you get in that shower, just say thank you for my hot shower. When you look at your bed and you make your bed because you gotta make your bed every day, no matter what, if you made your bed, you go home after a sucky day, you have your bed made, you're still a winner. Make that bed, feel good about yourself and say thank you for my eyes. Even if you might be a little bit tired, wipe the sleep from your eyes, splash some cold water on your face, and get to work. You have a job, you might have jobs. We're gonna be grateful for everything we have because gratitude is a magnet. All right, I get so excited, I gotta take a breath. Woo! Woo! Sing it with me. If you leave me more. Oh my God, I'm feeling all the feels, look. 
I got the chill. So my point is this. You have an opportunity today some people didn't get. So don't waste this opportunity for the pity party, sending out invitations, saying, so far, feel sorry for me, I'm tired, I'm this, I'm that. No, it's Monday, I love Monday. Mondays are like Fridays for me because I can get up and I can get exercising and I can get moving and I can get grooving and I can motivate my friends out there. Because let me tell you what, you've got work to do. You were given today. Some people didn't get today. So you are gonna do something with this day. You're gonna paint it beautiful. Remember, a butterfly is proof that you can go through some dark, ugly days and some darkness in that cocoon and have that metamorphosis where you spread your wings and you are beautiful. So remember that. I actually posted that on my Instagram. And I have a butterfly tattoo here. What does that mean? You're going through a metamorphosis. We have Jesse Ann K looking better than ever. We've got Janine kicking butt and taking names, body by Brazil in the house. We got Monica taking care of her son that just came out of a cast. You got things to do, and there's no time to look right or left. I want you to keep your eye on the prize. I didn't say fries. I said eye on the prize. Did she say fries? No, not french fries, fries. Okay, so I have my reps ready to go tomorrow. They're right here. <laughs> I'll be doing mine tomorrow, Wednesday and Thursday. Wednesday, we do have a workout, and it's our um, workout, regular workout, it's not yoga. So get ready to sweat this week and really break through that plateau. You're gonna break through the plateau this week mentally, emotionally, physically, and spiritually. You're gonna do the inner work in order to do the outer work. And please listen, before you know it, it's gonna be November. You can be looking at your book and reading November. Let me tell you this, there's only four spots for the November panels on the 12th and the 19th because it's Thanksgiving here in the States. So if you feel moved in your spirit and you're like, I wanna be on the panel on November 12th or the 19th, reach out to me, okay? And I'm just gonna pull from here. Keep your eye on the prize. In life, your goals and accomplishments are not going to be served to you on a silver platter. Newsflash. <laughs> just because you asked for them. Once you get clear on what your goals are and you put forth a strong work ethic, doing something every day towards your goals to crack that code, you must keep your eye on the prize. I want you, I want you to make sure you just savor this moment and understand that you can work towards your goals. You're gonna keep your eye on the prize. And that I love this powerful metaphor because the ebb and flow of life will knock you down and will knock you over. But you have your coach right here to hold you accountable. You have your coach to kind of firm you up and keep you in line, okay? I need you getting up. Don't make me throw the good book at you. Come on, queens, get up and get ass. Let me tell you what. If you put on your crown and you stand up tall and you take some deep breaths and you ring the bell and you say, you know what, Coach Janel is right. I'm gonna just take today and I'm going to name it and claim it. I'm gonna put the positive energy out there. I'm not gonna lose all my money that I've been already investing in myself on just one bad comment or somebody did this or somebody did that. I'm not gonna let them steal my joy. We came off a fierce feline Saturday shredder. Take that fearless energy into the week, okay? So to wrap everything up, I want you to understand that October, Rocktober, is full of positive energy. We got Mama Trixie walking for cancer. I'm wearing my, my pink for breast cancer. I'm, we're gonna be donating, we're gonna be doing changes. We're gonna be watching all of our calories. We're gonna be juicing more, sleeping better. Who out there can say, I'm sleeping better, I have more energy, I feel like I'm aging in reverse. People are saying, what are you doing? Because you look so young, you have that youthful glow. It's, the, it's inside, it's your spirit be, being happy. You're feeding your spirit. You're feeding your mind, body, and spirit, of course, with the nutrition and the workouts, but it's really this mental peace that surpasses all knowledge. You've stopped living in fear, and you started to trust yourself again, and you're feeling the fear, and you're doing it anyways. There you have it. All right, queens, I wanna let you know that we have got, I got more giveaways. Look, I mean, it's like, it just doesn't stop. This will be, a showcase on Thursday's Amazon Live. I'm putting these in, in giveaway boxes. We are just, our cup runneth over. I'm, I'm kind of like running out of space. My cup is running over so much, and that's a good thing, because then I can give, okay? Remember, the magnetic pull of an MRI is so strong that if you had like metal in your body, 
you know, maybe something. It would be ripped out of you. You need to have a magnetic field of your spirit so strong that when you project what you want out of life, it, it pulls into you. You rip it out of the universe. It just shoots right here. Yes, this has been proven that if you really put your mind into what you're doing and you don't let anybody or anything steal your focus or deflect your focus or demagnetize your magnetic field in your mind, body, and spirit, you will attract what you want. You will create miracles. You will have the body of your dreams. This is real talk. And I just want to say thank you, thank you, thank you for social media that I can sit here stand here in front of you and touch someone's life and make a positive influence okay thank you so much yelly thank you sam yes the power of prayer someone asked me what is your favorite exercise is it squats i'm like no prayer if you can keep it prayed up everything else is easy thank you thank you thank you ah uh, you gotta have energy someone just said you definitely have energy thank you you have to have energy if you can have all the intentions in the world i want to do this i want to do that if you don't have energy and you've not cracked your energy code like I have at 46, doing this for 20 years while raising a family, while doing all of my to-dos, you're not going to get anything done. Energy management. Here's some. Here's three energy hacks. Wake up every day at the same time. Go to sleep at the same time. Um, cold ice shower, ice facials in the morning to wake everything up. You can then also make sure you get a good night's rest. Put a notepad by your bed. If you're not able to shut your brain off, put it on the notepad and say, okay, lights out, mind off, meditate. This way you'll rest more so you can have more energy. And of course, whole foods. you got to have a green smoothie, keep juicing, lots of water, and that's going to give you energy. And also have your goals in front of you. It's a magnet. It's going to pull you. A lot of you are redoing your vision board. I'm doing a new vision board because I feel very inspired. All right, queens, I will see you at 8 a.m. If you're not a member, join JNLVIP.com. $1 for your first 30 days and $24.99 every month after that. No contract, no hidden fees. You actually are spoiled. We're giving away so hundreds and hundreds of dollars worth of goodies, gift cards, giveaways every week. It's like Christmas every day here, and I love it. All right, queens, I will see you at 8 a.m. Join JNLVIP.com and VIP Power on. Thank you, Jesse and Kate. Thank you, Gloria. Thank you, Shelby. I'll see you all now. Love you. Love you, Yelly. Thank you so much.